If we just know about our future, then we would focus about our present. Amen? So now, God is letting us see our future. Now, we have to focus on our present. Amen? So, the future has been revealed as what He said in His Word. Ano ba yung promise ni Lord God in Jeremiah 29, 11? God said, For I know the plan I have for you. Plan to give you hope and a future. Amen? So this future is not what we're thinking that I will prosper on earth, di ba? Parang all the prosperity in earth, I will have wealth, I will have things like this and things like that. I will have a big house, a big car. This is what we're thinking. Well, this is what we're thinking na future natin on earth. But actually, what we're thinking is, di ba, napaka-kunti naman ang iniling mo. Kasi sa plan ko for you. My plan for you is greater. It's far above the heaven, far above the earth. That is heaven. That is my plan for you. And in there you will truly prosper. Because I will bring you to the springs of living water na hindi ka mauubusan. My plan for you is not what you're thinking, diba? But God's greatest plan for us is far above than our earthly desires and dreams. This plan is to give us the brightest future found above the earth, and that is heaven. This is the promise of God to us. The future that He is always telling us. But every time we have a problem, we say, God, your plan for me is to give me hope and a future. I always said this to God. Whenever I worry, whenever I feel like, I don't know what's next. We're holding on to these words, Jeremiah 29, 11. But you know what? I was also surprised when I was doing this Lord's message na, Oh, ito pala yung plan mo sa amin. Ito pala, this is the plan. It's heavenly. Heavenly things. And guess what? If He can give us the future in heaven, how much more on earth, di ba? Na kaya kaya na control If He would give us, He will give us the future in heaven, which is already revealed and unveiled. How much more on earth? So let's just think about about it. If He's already there, He only sees us in heaven. Then for sure that He will also prosper us on earth. Amen. So we don't have to worry about things on earth because He already sees us in heaven. And knowing that He already sees us in heaven, then what are we worrying on earth? We are already victorious. We are already there. So it means that along the way on earth is already victorious. All our ways is already cleared up. Diba? So we don't, we don't have to worry about things on earth actually. Because God already sees us in heaven. And we also have to see what God sees. The vision of God is what should be our vision. God said that He is the beginning and the end. If He is the beginning and He is the end, then He knows about the present. He knows the things in between beginning and the end. Amen? And He said there, you remember what God said that before He went to heaven, right? He said, I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you to myself. That where I am, there you may be also. Amen, right? Praise Lord God, thank you so much for, for this promise. Thank you so much for right now, God probably is already prepared. Probably the place that we will be celebrating in heaven has been prepared. Our room in heaven has been prepared. It has been prepared. Everything has been prepared. Amen? So while, while actually we are busy on earth looking for the future by our own, Jesus was raised to heaven to prepare our place there in that place as He promised us to give. 
and probably it's already finished it has been prepared amen we're just waiting for him to come and take him with himself amen so our future is now at hand nandu na sa kamay niya amen and let us drop all of our new plans and take his best plan for us our future is great enough that only God can hold it diba tako na tako pues siguro pinagtatawa na lang tayo ng Panginoon <laughs> ito lang yung nakikita niya mas malaki yung nakikita ko sa kanya sa na gusto ko para sa kanya diba? Amen So as we wait, let's take a look at our present life as divine foreshadowing our, of our future So live as a citizen in heaven No, hindi ako Martian, hindi ako pupunta sa red planet I'm not a Martian I am a citizen in heaven Amen? I am a child of God So I should be there And then you have a new earth that God is preparing for me, not in the other planet, diba? Amen.